Oh, Street Fighter collab. We had a good time, man. You and me, we had a very good time. Good time. Very good time. Very good time. Street Fighter characters in Battle Cats. Ah! No! <laughs> no! The Street Fighter collab has been one of those rare events where I've actually done everything. I've done everything apart from the guaranteed draw now. Who do I want? I don't know. Probably the Legend Rare, honestly. <laughs> if I was going to choose someone, it would be the exclusive limited Legend Rare. The rarer the better for me, honestly. Super duper whooper pooper if you, if you please. If you want to use the correct terminology for Legend Rare. But it is a 0.3% chance, so honestly, I'm not really banking on it. I'm not the biggest fan of Street Fighters. However, I've enjoyed this collab thoroughly. I'll get to the point soon. We're going to be doing roles on the collab units. But first, I want to give my names to all these characters. Usually, I don't remember the names properly. So I have to make my own, my own names up for stuff. And here we go. You got Hudouken, Thick Thighs. That guy with the music theme. Daddy, please don't hurt me. Sonic and Hulk had a baby. Gandhi, American Hudouken, Rare unit that I really want. Now, out of all these characters, who do I want the most? Um, I think uh, Daddy Please Don't Hurt Me is a pretty good one. I actually need more zombie killer Ubers, so you know what? I'll take Zangief. Sorry, I'll take Daddy Please Don't Hurt Me. Music theme guy? Eh, eh, seems okay, not really that fast. Thick thighs, so good. Like, her, like, knockback seems really good and useful to red, black, and aliens, plus her range seems really good when I was fighting against her. So I'm kind of, like, edging towards that. Uh, Ryu? Sorry, Hudouken guy. Yeah, I mean, he's like the, the main dude. I, I'm like, man, I, I can I can sleep on him. I, as in, I'll sleep on getting him. I don't want to, I'm not going to sleep on, I mean, he's, look, don't get me wrong. He's, he's he works in his body and not. <sighs> look, I'm more of a fan of, of Thick Thighs, okay? Gandhi, he seems okay. He seems all right. I wouldn't mind having Gandhi. Hulk, Sonic, Breed, okay too. American Hudouken, eh. Eh, I can, I can, I can take or, or leave it. I don't really care. Uh, this guy I would love though. All right, moving on. Let's finally do it. We have a 750 special cat food special guaranteed special. Matt Shea, uh, the other week did, a, did some rolls on Street Fighters um, without guarantee. It hurt me. Really sad if I don't get one. But then again, he makes so much money off Battle Cats. It's kind of like, well, why not? By the way, it's really good to see him just have some fun in the game. He was literally just having fun in the game. Good for him. But honestly, yeah, Matt Shea, loving the facial hair, suits you very well. Well done. Very jealous. So let's start off the tickets first, and then we'll do the the cat food. I still don't really know what character I want, apart from obviously the Legend Rare. Super duper whooper pooper. Yeah, I'll take Thick Thighs. I think Thick Thighs would be a really good character. Um, Daddy, please don't hurt me. Would be a great character too to have my squad. Again, though, the whole like, you know, they're collab Ubers and therefore not really that great comes into play here. Oh, figure skating cat. Yo, any super rare? I will take, by the way. I will take any super rare at all. Loving the super rares. Why? NP, that's why. Even if they suck ass, you have some NP there. And NP is so useful now in this game. You can kind of hypermax with MP. A lot of people didn't like that change. However, me personally, I'm like, you know what? It's not really like a multiplayer game as of such, right now at least. By the way, baby boy. So you know what? I like the MP change. Psycho Cats. Uh, I forget what Psycho Cat even does. I'm pretty sure he's just gonna be MP though. He's like five MP to me. Uh, you are a great floating meat shield. But does hypermaxing you do anything, honestly? Do I want to add more levels to him? I don't think so, man. I think he does what he does. He's a meat shield. He takes, like, a couple of damage, and that's it. Um, which cat? I'm pretty sure you evolve into, like, Sorcerer's Cat. Who, honestly, I don't use at all, so you probably be MP2. Pirate Cat, you knock back red enemies, and therefore, you don't need to be leveled up any further. So you should be MP2. Yo, I love this way of, like, rationalizing what needs to be MP'd more than the other way. You are Ramen Cat, a very, very good cat against angels. Sometimes not even against angels. But you are a great cat. I might just level you up even further, even though you are a kind of meat shield too. Yo, Cat Toaster. I don't really... Keep forgetting what Katos even is or what he does. Use now. I want to see this. I've never ever leveled up Cat Toaster. He's been level three for so long. Same thing with figure skating cats. I've only ever gotten one figure skating cat. Well, now two. Holy crap! Out of all the rolls I've done, I've only ever gotten one of those. 
And that was kind of recent too. All right, so no Ubers. Um, am I upset? Yes. <laughs> yes, I am. But we've we've been so lucky recently so far. Like honestly, the past rolls we've had has been ridiculous. So I'm kind of like, look, Ponos, I appreciate the luck you're giving me, but you're making people jealous. I'll be fine with just one Uber here, as long as it's like Chun Li or. I guess, Daddy, please don't hurt me. I'll take Gandhi too. All right, let's go. Uh, yes. And we still have a thousand cat food for the next, like, offer. Yo, it's still really good. Juliet cat, great succulent NP, yes. But also really good against angels. Maybe don't MP. Yo, okay, Ryu cats, pretty cool. Not like, you know, buzzing off the walls about it. Sorry, that's not even Ryu cat, it's, it's Hadouken man. Hadouken man. Yay! Will I ever use him? No, he's a trophy. He's go he's going right on my trophy wall area shelf. He's pretty cool. Okay, not like <laughs> honestly, not too fast about it, not too excited. But like, what I am gonna be excited about is Chun Li or maybe Daddy. Please don't hurt me. I don't know. Shaman Cat, Bath Cat, super rare. Okay, Witch Cat. Yeah, you exist. Well done. Silent Cat. You'd always want to use, by the way. Always use Silent Cat. Fencer Cat. A great barrier breaker. You might need him actually in the newest one. Sushi Cat. I'm pretty sure you are useful. I'm not too sure what you turn into, but I, 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 I think I remember you being somewhat useful on other people's videos. Yo, Daddy! Please don't hurt me. Okay, yo, we got two Ubers. That's great news. A bit lewd for YouTube, honestly. Showing a little bit too much inner thigh, but okay. Also, damn, his hair is very selective in areas. Like, what, what's going on with his shins? <laughs> or is that part of his boots? I don't know. Anyways, what a scary looking character. He terrifies me. Nothing game changing, but you know what? It's really cool to have these units here. So we've got Zangief, which is pretty awesome. And Hudukun. there we go. Um, actually, before I do anything, um, yes, yes, come on, Chun Li, come on, thick thighs, thick thighs, please. Oh, you suck ass. You know what? I'm pretty happy about it. I got two characters with brand new uh, talents or abilities here. Look, brand new ability, Savage Blow. There you go. It's kind of like Critical Chance, except it doesn't really work well on metal enemies. However, it's really good in general. I think it does more damage than Critical Chance as well. And then we have dodge here, right? You have dodge. Yeah, dodge attacks temporarily avoids all damage from attacks from the target enemy type. So he would go out to battle against, you know, uh, zombies. Now, one of the zombies I'm really struggling against is the big uh, boo-boo guy. I forget his name. He's like the McDonald's creature. He's a big purple pile of shit. And I hate him. He is not affected by any of the abilities or effects. Therefore, a lot of anti-zombie uh, Ubers I have don't really cut it out for him. So having Zangief here might be really good. It might be a little uh, godsend. He's immune to all of his effects, which is gonna be really good here. Area effect, yo, immune to knockback? That's so good, what a tank. It's almost like you need Omni Strike for zombie runs now. Area attack, of course, dodge attack seems extremely good. Uh, when I tested it out, I maybe got like really lucky, apparently. Um, the, the dodge chance is pretty low. However, for me, it seems so good. It's really hard to tell when you can't see their, their health bar. But for me, the ability kept on popping up and therefore it seemed like it was doing absolute work. The dodge ability seems so good. Anyways, we're gonna make him black now. So... But you know what? I'm gonna max, I'm gonna max him out. Uh, no I'm not. My money's gone. And my money, I mean experience points. I might get used to level 10, hopefully. Nope, okay. Well, I made a big boo-boo there. <laughs> It's all gone. Hadouken man! A hero walking the path of a true fighter. Okay, he evolves, blah, 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 blah. Daddy, please don't hurt me. Unlocked. A towering wrestler called Red Cyclone. Omni Strike might avoid zombie damage and he evolves into the superior being. So much more superior than this pale, shitty Red Cyclone. Submit to the force of his Cyclone Lariat. Is that how you say Lariat? I forget. I know what Lariat is. It's when like you, you smack someone down with like the inside of your arm, you go <laughs> something like that. I've seen an anime, so I'm pretty much an expert. And what a better place to test them out in the Arena of Honor. Right now, there's a brand new event, Arena of Honor, where you get to fight Street Fighter characters. Yay! I seek the strongest. Okay, let the bar begin. Let's do this. You know what? I know like the collab units and therefore not very good. However, 
I feel like they have potential. They're, they're not the worst Ubers out there. And I'm pretty sure Pornos would do justice to them and make them somewhat good, right? Even Galleon, they made some of the units actually pretty goddamn powerful. My Segoi purple mecha robot, uh, super good, honestly. So people would argue that, but I, I would definitely say he's super good. Uh, we should probably summon something. Uh, let's start with you then. Oh my god, you see that coming towards you? On the other side of the street, you run. You run as fast as you can. He's coming. Daddy's coming. <laughs> so scary. <laughs> he's more muscle than man. What is he? He has no knockback, so you can't hurt him, ever. So he's gonna destroy you guys. With no knockbacks, he seems like a really good city unit. You may be against Cyclones. No knockback is extremely good, right? Or maybe he'll just die so quickly, it doesn't even matter, I don't know. So far, he's doing a great job of not dying, so honestly, props to him. We'll send a Balrog to accompany him. He seems like a really good unit. Honestly, I think Zangief is actually like one of the best units here. I'm actually now really happy. Zangief actually seems pretty dumb. You can go ahead and tell me in the comments down below. Oh, he's not that good, Chauncey. But you know what? Every single goddamn unit is good. You just don't know how to use him, okay? There, I said it. A true expert knows how to use and utilize every single unit in the game. Technically, every single unit in the game is a good unit. All right, shows how much you know. All right, Zangief is finally dead. However, he did put in work and his recharge time isn't like, the worst. I would love to summon Ryu, but uh, he would just die very quickly. Oh, this this Chun Li is doing my head in right now. All right, we need a uh, we need a Dark Tanyan Cat here. Stat, please. Poor Barra can't even do anything. He's not even attacking anymore either. So we're gonna go reset here. Summon Dark Tanyan Cat. Chun Li is so, look at that range and like constant attack there, just knocking back everything. She's such a good unit. I would have absolutely have loved Thick Thighs. Chun Li, will you stop it? Stop kicking my cat in the face! Chun Li! Oh my god, Chun Li, you suck! I hate you! Chun Li! Stop it! Oh my god! Chun Li! Uh, try complete. Oh, okay. <laughs> Ew! 46% sucks ass! Anyways, what rewards do you get for this event? Probably the same ones you get usually. This, it's totally worth it if you are beginning. You should still do it. If you are high player, you probably already know you should be doing it. Look at that. It's free cat food first off. That's it. That's all I have to say. Free cat food. Honestly, 70 cat food, I'll take it. All right, I'll move on. Maybe get this one as well, actually. All right, that was fun. That was a video, a very short video, probably. So I apologize for that. Uh, next week, there won't be as many Bad Cats episodes. I know, re, I'm super mad. Blah blah blah. I know. I apologize, but we will be having some uh, Battle Cats esque videos that isn't Battle Cats, if you know what I mean. I'm, so like, okay, I guess one of them is like a Battle Cat ripoff, and the other one is a game made by Ponos, not out in English yet. I'm gonna try and do that one hopefully next week. Anyways, that was fun. I had I had fun. Hope you guys had fun too. Uh, before you go, um, promotion time! Promotion! Promoting me! Time to promote myself! Uh, hey, I'm a YouTuber. I don't know if you knew that or not. Uh, I do videos that isn't Battle Cats. So, hey, check this out. Look, it's me trying to be smart. I'm doing IQ tests and stuff. I'm not really IQ tests. It's a free app that you can play alongside with me. It's like those, you know, those, those questions that are like, oh, it seems straightforward. Oh no, there's like a deeper meaning to the question. It's a trick question. Oh no. And they think they're so smart. And I'm like, well, I'm pretty big brain. So honestly, you should take the test too. See if you're a dumb dumb or a big brain now with this new video exclusive to my channel because I I made it on this for my channel. Okay, and you're back. You're back in the room. All right. Um. Passion points. Give them to me. <laughs> and video. We don't have much in terms of tickets. That's okay. That's fine. You. 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 you.